on October 6, the World Health Organization made a historic announcement. It endorsed the first ever malaria vaccine for children. The RTSS vaccine, Moscurix, was endorsed in sub-Saharan Africa and in other regions with moderate to high malaria transmission. The WHO made its recommendations based on the results from a pilot program administering the vaccine to children in Africa. Malaria is a life-threatening disease caused by microorganisms that belong to the genus Plasmodium. It is transmitted by infected female Anopheles mosquitoes. According to the WHO, in 2019, there were around 229 million cases of malaria and over 40,000 deaths across the world. About 67% of the deaths were among children aged under 5 and 94% of the cases and deaths were reported in the African region. RTSS A01 is a recombinant protein-based vaccine that acts against P. falciparum, the deadliest malaria parasite globally and the most prevalent in Africa. The new vaccine reportedly offers no protection against P. vivax malaria found in many countries outside Africa. The development of the vaccine was led by pharma major GSK over 30 years ago. A 5-year phase 3 efficacy and safety trial was concluded in 2014. In July 2015, the European Medicines Agency authorized the use of the vaccine since the benefits of the vaccines outweigh the risks. Known side effects of the vaccine include pain and swelling at the injection site and fever similar to other children's vaccines. It is associated with an increased risk of febrile seizures within 7 days of administration, which is harmless. and there were no long lasting consequences pilot projects were launched in malawi ghana and kenya over 2019 the results showed that among children aged 5 to 17 months who received the recommended four doses of rtss the vaccine prevented approximately 4 in 10 cases of malaria over 4 years of follow up It prevented severe malaria in about 3 in 10 cases with a significant reduction in overall hospital admissions due to malaria or severe anemia. Health workers reported that the vaccine was easy to introduce and integrate into their schedule. Malaria is a major public health problem in India. It is an endemic to many states and involves multiple plasmodium species including P. falciparum. Therefore, India will definitely benefit from the new vaccine. In India, Bharat Biotech has entered into a partnership with GSK for technology transfer and production. According to reports, This vaccine is likely to be ready for use in India in a couple of years.